Now I'm down in Tribeca, right next to the narrow But I'll be hood forever, I'm the new Sinatra And since I made it here, I can make it anywhere Yeah, they love me everywhere, I used to cop in Harlem All of my Dominicanos right there up on Broadway Pulled me back to that McDonald's, took it to my stash box Welcome back to All New York Sports We give you the best of my coverage about the Yankees, Mets, Giants, Jets, Knicks and Nets Alright, so let's get right into it. I think I, yeah, I did. I did explain to you guys yesterday how the Knicks played the Nets. Um, and yeah, it was just a, it was a pretty good game. And it was close uh, all four quarters. And uh, yeah, just, let's uh, get into the stats. Um, Courtney Lee had tw led, uh, led the team with 27 points. And along with that, he had four rebounds and three assists. So great, um, great job by Courtney Lee stepping up in Porzingis' absence. Oh, by the way, um, Chris Porzingis, uh, I'm sure he, any Nick fan knows who he is. Um, Porzingis left the game in the second quarter and with a leg injury, and he's questionable to play on Saturday. Uh, he did not play the rest of the game uh, last night, so we're going to see how that goes out. And, uh, yeah, no news yet on him. But, yeah, Cornelius did a great job kind of stepping up for Porzingis because he was out, and along with all three other players like Jared Jack and, um, yeah, and, uh, and his candidate did good work too. And so, uh, yeah, for the Nets, um, Excuse me, uh, Spencer Dinwiddie had also had 26 points, 7 rebounds, and 7 assists. So good um, good performance by uh, Dinwiddie. Because as you guys know, I said every, every episode until D'Angelo Russell re returns, he will be the starting point guard. And um, yeah, so that's going to do for today's episode, guys. Um, uh, just subscribe, like, do what you want. Thank you.